This is me here. Um, you guys had, um, actually, I told you in the comments. Um, sorry. But, oh, I just had a, um, I'm just putting a video on, or it's just gonna be used as noise. Doesn't really matter. Anyway, so this is the, um, so we actually did a, um, so I actually said in the comments of this garbage truck that we will be, um, so I think I said it, I'm pretty sure I said it at the end of the video. I'm pretty sure I said it at the end of the video that, that the, um, that I will be, like, if I'm lucky enough, or if I come back to Toys R Us, I might be able to get the Western Star tow truck. Um, and I did, and... I even said in another video, or in the comments section, I said in the- I made my own comment saying, Oh, I will, like, like I will basically make more truck videos. So, yeah. Pretty cool. Um, so, I did it. So, and this is the truck. So, this is a Matchbox Real Working Rigs. For some reason, it's called the Working Rigs, but it's actually the Real R W R. But they decided to put it W R. So I know it's kind of weird, but I think we'll just mostly call it the Real Working Rigs. Let's just not. Let's just stop. Okay, we'll actually call it the Real Working Rigs. These are the Real Working Rigs, and now unlike this one, this is not changed. The casting. This casting has not been changed. It's the same same tow truck uh, throughout the years. Um, this tow truck was um, so if you don't know these, so this truck was like from a long time ago. Or these rigs, so these rigs were like made um, somewhere in like 2009 or something. I don't know, but they were pretty cool looking trucks and two like. Like, I was not able to buy them because I was too small for them and I didn't even knew these trucks, so I'm very glad I started to notice today. But yeah, it's a, it's a pretty cool looking truck. Um, so we're going to open it up. It shows you you can move the towing hook and it shows the same thing, but there's this one. It shows you towing the garbage truck. Hey, that's the garbage truck we have. It's the JY. Oh yeah, uh, come back to my garbage truck video if you want to watch this. So if you want to, if you want to watch my garbage truck video, you can either Google it or you can go to my channel or something. Anyway, I did a review on this one, the Garbage King. Now we're gonna look at the Western Star 6900XD. I forgot to say that. It's a little damaged, but that's okay. So let's just open this up. Wow, that was really easy. I think I op I don't know if I opened it, but I don't know. I think it came like this. I don't know. Uh, anyway, so... Oh my gosh. Wow. I cannot believe this. The crane actually moves. It only goes up and down. It does not turn. But it's okay. Does it even slide? Oh, yes, it does. Wait, I didn't even feel... Oh! Wow, that's really sweet! Oh, I think this might be my favorite one. Although, you know what? I think these two garbage trucks will be my favorite one, unless they release the Kenworth, which I'm also doing the same thing with, I just said, to the Western Star. So if I'm, if I come back to, um... I think it's the next month they release the Mix D. This is Mix A or something. The other was Mix B, and the other is Mix C. I think I'm gonna. I think in Mix C we might get the Kenworth T800 roll-off truck, which will be my 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 like one of my favorite trucks. Like for now on, these two are my favorites out of the fire truck or the scraper. So yeah, the crane. So the crane does move. The the thing does shift or something or slides. It does not.
turn, but it just it just basically goes up and down. Let's see if we can pull the hook out. I think it's I think it locks it. So if you want the thing, if you want this, this is actually I think called a tow bar or like a wheel bar. This is where the wheel would go to. And if you want it out, I guess you're supposed to pull this. It's a little stiff. Oh, there we go. Pretty cool. You can open it now. And then if you want, you can put it back. Um, if you can't even see, I don't know if you see it. If I move it, I'm actually going to push it back. So if you, I don't know if you see it, but there's like this knob. When you pull it all the way, it stops. It does not go further. It, 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 it does not do that. But it's still okay though, I mean, it's cool. You can put it back like that, and you can pull it out. Okay, I hope I did not break that. Anyway, very cool looking truck. Pretty cool details. Um, yeah. You can actually, oh that's cool, you can either tow it farther like that or extend it, or you can do it like this. I think I'm going to do it like this. Oh wait a minute! No! Oh wait, I realize. When you lower it down, you're going to do this. Oh, okay, okay, this is, like when you lift it like that, that means you're going to, like, pull it. When you're like this, that means you're going to lower it and you're about to put the wheels, okay. I mean, it still works, I mean, it's a little heavy, this one, I think this one is light, I like the sounds of it, it actually would be a pretty good ASMR sound, or Osmar, whatever you call it, um, pretty nice exhaust stacks, I think they might break off if you, like, I don't want to actually break these off, but I think they would if I give this to, like, a smaller child, <clears throat> okay, let's see what you can, let's see if you can, okay, so it says that it, can tow. It's like sort of farther. It's like somewhere here like this. So let's see. Oh, oh, oh. I think you could kind of, but I don't think so. Oh, there we go. Oh, okay. Um, let's see if we... Nope. So you can't even... You can't really tow the vehicle um well you can tow it if you lift it up but i wouldn't do that because it's a little annoying but i think you would be able yeah it would be nice if the arm was stiff so that it wasn't this loose the arm is a little loose on this one maybe they're all like that but i mean it still looks nice sorry about that anyway Pretty cool looking truck. Um, it does. T it's just, it's, um, so yeah. Actually, I forgot to show you this. You could, if you want, fold it back like that and lock it. it can't come out. It'll only come out if you if you pull it out. There we go. There we go. I'm pretty sure you can see if it if if it works on the hook. Nope, it doesn't. So the hook doesn't. Well, it. Nope. We'll just say it doesn't work. It it sort of works if you do it like that, but I don't think that counts. I think that's cheating. But you want to like, I don't know. So I guess that's how you're supposed to tow it. So it goes like that. But the problem is that since this is a cab over truck, because this thing is a, in the way, the wheels are too far out, so you can't even... This is how much you can tow. You can only tow it like this. Like, you can imagine the wheel could have been there. But because this is a cab over, you can't. But in the picture, they did, so that's kind of strange. But, um, let's see if we can tow it, even though we're out Oh! Oh, oh! 
Oh, it, it's sort of... Wait. Oh, you know what? I think I know what's happening. Well, I don't know. Anyway, so... So you could tow it sort of like that. I think it's resting... It, it's like resting here or something. Now, since you can't do that, there's actually a good trick I heard you can do. You, um, now, even though you can sort of do what I did, you can do it like that. But what's funny is that, but what's good is that when you do it like that, sometimes you can actually do a cool trick. What you do, you can put the towing, you can put one of the horns or something underneath the wheel. So the wheel has like this, it's like sort of, like you can put it, like it kind of locks on or hooks on, you see? Um, so you can actually, let's see if we can, I think we can lock it. There we go. It's, like, see? Let me show you how it, so it actually, so you're actually doing that, it slides in. So each, you know, all wheels, all wheels, they're always made like that. It has some holes on the wheels. You know, I'm gonna show you how, like, what I mean. See how there's like, oh, like, see how there's some room underneath the wheel? So the wheel's actually like a shell or something, or empty underneath. So it's not really, like, I don't know. But you are able to actually tow it though. But the way to tow it is you're gonna have to do it like this. Let's see. So, from what I heard, I heard so. As I said, you can actually tow it like this also. Um, you just have to put the... So you know the, the wheel thing? Since it cannot go to the wheel, you have to actually use it as like a hook. So it, it actually has to go inside or slips in there like this. So, it, so when you do that, it kind of tows. Let's see if it works though. I think it actually works on this side better. So it actually... So the... This part here, since it's like that, it not only sort of rounds it up a little bit there, but it, it just hooks like that. You just simply hook it on like that, and then you carefully, I guess, bring it to ground, or you can... I don't know how, it's, like, this is how you would do it. You carefully bring it to the ground. It's already shifted, by the way, the, the tow crane or something, and then you can tow it. You can even turn it, which is unusual. Um, it's a little tricky to play with, but I think I love it actually. So let's see if it can turn. Oh wow! Oh, it does. Now what's funny is that in real life, these things are actually supposed to turn, but on this one it doesn't. But since it's like a flimsy sort of plastic, you can actually make it look like you're able to turn it. Um, what, so it actually sort of bends. Let me show you how. So, as I said, you hook it on like that. Or if you want, actually leave it like that. And, and then the wheel, the wheel should actually hook on to the, like this. Something like that. So let me show you. So it's like that. You see, see how the the the, t the horns or whatever is inside the wheel. That's how you can tow it, I guess. Like that's what you can all do on any truck, whether it's a cab over engine or a truck like that, like the front of it. This you're gonna have to tow it like that. The first off, the hook is very useless. Second, it's kind of in the way, so you can't even put the wheel there. But I think when doing this might be actually a good towing idea because sometimes this thing holds on but most of the time it doesn't so thank goodness like a youtuber name I forget what his name was but he did a review like he did four reviews about these real working rigs he got the the Pierce Viosity, he got the Garbage King, he got the Scraper and then he got the Western Star and there was a part when he showed you that you can actually put the hook like that, or something like that, or the, the, the apparatus. I think it's called an apparatus. So I guess we're gonna have to tow it like this. 
first off, the I think I, I think I know why you can't is because the hook is too small, and it's like it's it's actually lining up so well that when you try to put the bumper or hook it there, you can't even. There's it's like very small. It's too small to hook. So the idea is, I guess, to tow it there like that. In fact, most tow trucks actually use that to tow rather than just using a hook. So you don't you don't even use the hook to tow. I think it's meant to like I don't know pick up the thing or something. I don't know. But yeah, this is how you're gonna have to tow. So you're gonna have to tow it like this. It actually turns though. It so you actually have to be a little. It's a little tricky to play with when turning. It's easier when you're driving straight. Oh jeez. Let me actually. All right, guys. So as I said before. Um, so, again, this is how, you, so if you actually want to really tow this guy, or tow any truck, you're going to have to put the, the apparatus sort of, like, one notch inside the wheel. Kind of like this. See how it slides? You have to do it like that. And since sometimes the thing doesn't want to, like, if it doesn't, like, you're going to have to sometimes keep repeating this. <laughs> Actually, I don't know. Anyway, so this is how you're gonna tow it. So let's see how good it tows. Um, wow, it's actually not bad. Um, let's see this way. Um, this way. Well, I know why because, as I said, this side. Because when you're turning, I think this other notch that's underneath, that's like, so the notch right here. It's probably gonna hit the the like the step there that it just doesn't want to turn. But it's okay though. I mean, you can imagine how it works. I think he, I mean, at least it's a tow trick. You can either, you know what? It's actually optional because you can either tow it. You can either put it like if you put it this way, then it'll turn better to the left or something or right, whatever. But if you put it the other way, it's gonna do the same thing. And yeah, you gotta you you're gonna have to sometimes do this, do that on the wheel when you're turning or something, because sometimes the wheel likes to come off or something. I don't know, but this is how you're gonna tow uh, when you're towing trucks. So if you actually want to tow vehicles, as I said, then you're gonna have to put the wheel. You're gonna have to put the. You're gonna have to hook it up like this. You're gonna have to put it in there like that. Actually. Yeah, you're gonna have to put it like this. You're gonna have to kind of hook it up like that. And then when you're ready or something, or you can either do it like that, how I hooked it up, or if you wanna actually do it like roadly, like you wanna, like without your hands, you just, I guess, simply put it on there. And if it, if the if, if 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 you feel like that the last notch or something hits inside the wheel, then that means you actually t um, hooked it up correctly or how you should. So yeah, it actually does turn. You can even go backwards. Okay, so let's see. Let's see how this looks. Yeah, this thing. Yeah, this thing really turns well. <laughs> so, yeah. Actually, I wonder if we can even tow it in the back. Let's see. Okay, the back is better. Because, you know what? Oh, yeah. Wait. Okay, the... Okay, so when you're towing it like this, it's better. This time. You see? This is what it's supposed to do. The wheel is supposed to lie down. You see that? This is what you can do. Yeah, the, yeah, it actually works better if you're towing it backwards. But if you tow it in the front, you're gonna have to like, like instead of just putting it on the wheel, you're gonna have to put this on the wheel. So it's not actually really gonna, like, it's not really on the wheel like it's supposed to. Instead, it's gonna be sort of, it's gonna be like that, you know. And yeah, that's how you're gonna tow it. Actually. So you just simply lock it on there and you're ready to go basically. It's 
I mean, I still like it though, even though it may not be able, like it may not have some a um, able, able abilities to tow. I still like it. You know, what? let's see how the squeaky. I forgot about that. Let's see if this one squeaks. Um, so if you want, you can actually put it back, as I said. So you just. Oh, oh. Sorry about that, guys. So sorry. I don't have a. I'm gonna. This is. So I actually put my arm on top of the tablet to record. So I don't even have a holder or something. In fact, it's hard to make one. So if you want, you can pull this out. You can lift the arm there or whatever. And then you push this back to lock it. It's actually really simple to do. Um, it's a little stiff, and then if you want, you can push this back in. It sort of actually lifts up while you push it all the way in. See? See how it, so it's like flat. When you lift it up, it sort of lifts up. Because I think it's because of this. See the So when you when you slide it, it starts to lift up sort of. But that's when you're wanting to tow. And if you're not gonna tow, you just push it back there and it starts to get flat. And then you're ready to, I guess, drive around free. And you can not only drive it free, but in case, even though you're driving on the way, and then there's like this emergency or whatever, you can just, I don't know, s still drive like that and then it's whatever. So, this is what it would, this is how you, so when you're, so when you're wanting to drive it by itself without towing anything, instead of just leaving it free like that, then you just put it back like that. So this is... So... So, let me show you what I mean. So, this is... Oh my gosh. This is what it would look like when you're towing. When you want to tow. But when you're not ready to tow, or when you're done towing, or when you don't... Like, when you're... When you don't have any time, or when you're not having a feeling to tow, just put it back like that, just, so you just lock it, like you should, so you just, so you just fold this, okay, I'm gonna have to, alright guys, so if you want to lock it, you put this arm up first, and then you push, you push this in, push this in like that, make sure it, it clicks or locks into place, should go all the way, then, you, uh, you pull it, you pull it, um, you pull the, uh, the crane, um, you pull it back to lock it. So, 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 when you're done, like, like, after you fold the, the, uh, the arm and then you lock the, the, uh, the, the hook, you, um, you, you pull this back, or, um, or, or just slide it back to, uh, like, back where it was, and then it, it starts to, and then, and then you're done, and then you can drive around like this if you want to. Um, I actually have some other vehicles to show you, I think I can actually tow it. So yeah, it's a pretty cool looking tow truck, I mean... Actually, you know what? This color might be my favorite one because I actually like reds and I thought this might be a red. My dad or whoever thought that this was a fire truck, but this is not. Although it almost looks like it because of the color, but it's actually not. Let me tell you guys. Um, and gals, I guess. So, so, as for comparison, these trucks are big enough for your Hot Wheels and Matchbox cars. I'm pretty sure, imagine this Hudson Hornet, I think, imagine how big this Hudson Hornet would be, this Hudson Hornet would be about this size, but a garbage truck would be about this size, so a garbage truck would be bigger than a police car, a tow truck is the same thing, and yeah, um, so that's how big it was. Um, I have another truck that's sort of similar size, although it's not really the best one. This can actually, this is a flatbed tow truck. You can actually tow a vehicle, but I did not know that this is actually a treasure hunt. But yeah, that's what you can do. 
so as I said before, you can either. Hang on, I'm gonna have to show you. Okay, guys, so you can also. <laughs> now, this is gonna be funny. You can actually also tow a car if you like. Actually, it actually works better with a car. Um, or you can even tow another tow truck like that. Um, let's see if the hook works. No, the hook sort of, but I, I think I would use the, the wheel bar or something to tow because it actually works really good. Um, so let's try and, let's try this big guy here. This is an oil tanker truck which I reviewed. It's the, uh, Maisto one. Let's see if that one tows. Well, he's not bad. He's sort of the same thing. Um, it might actually work. Oh, okay. Um, it sort of works like. Mm, uh, I don't know. Good for show. Maybe we let's just try the hook also. If it works well, the hook. Okay, it's nope. the The hook is a fail. But the towing thing, the wheel bar. I don't know what it's actually called, let me know in the comments. Um, but it actually works really well, but the other's a fail for some odd reason. But anyway... <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, you can also tow, tow a car. Wait, you can also actually tow a car. Let's see if you can tow it like that. Nope, I don't think so. I guess it's just good for show or something. I don't know. Just put it back like that. Um, so, yeah. Anyway, oops. Whoops. Whoopsie, whoops. As I said before, these tow trucks are actually... Since this is a bigger tow truck, I think these are called wreckers, while the other ones are called tow trucks. Whatever. These kinds of tow trucks, these big ones here, or these big rigs or the tow trucks, these are meant to tow um, bigger castings or bigger vehicles, like buses or maybe tractor trucks or gar like it's meant to tow trucks and buses and like other sort of large vehicles. Except for a giant dump truck or whatever. It, as I said, this is meant to tow like trucks like these, trucks like that, or even trucks like this. But the smaller tow trucks, like the flatbed one, or the the smaller tower trucks, are meant to tow these cars or tow cars like these or this whatever. But it's not meant to tow trucks. This is not meant to tow cars either. Okay. Anyway, I forgot to talk about the details. So you got your all your toolbox doors. I like how the back of it is like that. It's pretty cautional or cool. I think this is a pretty cool looking truck. Um so let's see how squeaky he is though. Oh wow, he's actually not that noisy. This one is noisy. I think he's noisy because he he probably it's probably because of the plastic plastic is like a little, it's either the plastic or is it the metal base? I don't know, this, the plastic is wrapping around the, the, the axle. I think the metal is wrapping around, yeah. I think it's the wheel or the metal. I don't know what's making it squeaky, but this one is just fine. And I like how, so the, so I actually want to see what's, Okay, this one is a little heavy, but he's not that heavy. This one is fine. He's not that heavy. I think he's light. I don't know. But these trucks are not as... Um, these trucks are like... I don't know how much weight there are, but I think this one is a little heavier due to the metal... Due to the fact that... I don't know. Maybe the metal on this one is thicker or something? Maybe it, it actually has a metal sort of chassis and a metal in a plastic base. This one is a plastic base, metal rear back. This is plastic, the 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 crane or the whole towing part. This is plastic. The, the cab is metal. The grill 
is plastic. The steps are plastic. The exhaust stacks are plastic. The bumper is also plastic. It's actually attached to the base. So, yeah. Pretty good quality for kids. I think these are pretty fun looking toys to play with. Um, this one, this one has some moving parts. I think there's like a lot of them. I don't know. Um, the garbage truck is pretty awesome. The Western Star is awesome. Um, for some odd reason. So, there's actually many versions or many color variations of these Western Star tow trucks. There was one that was, of course, this one. And then there's a red, there's like a another red one but it's like a I think it's like a darker red which is actually the older version so try not to get confused about that this is the new one there is a black one with yellow or something there's like a black one I also like that one there's a green one which I also like I actually like all of them I think they're pretty cool colors um I like how the I think I would I think I like the black one more than the more than the I think I'll just have to say that I like all of them. Um, the I think it's pretty cool. The truck. Um, yeah, I think it's a pretty cool looking truck. Um, sometimes the uh, I think the the plastic look to the grill is sometimes I think a little different or something. I don't know, but I it's the same thing: plastic grill, plastic base, plastic steps. It's the same, same, same truck. Um, other than that, I think these two would get, go to a great combination. In fact, they even match in the picture. Like, like we can actually, like it shows you that this truck can tow that one. Now, it's not only a garbage truck that can be towed. You can use this truck to tow other vehicles. You can tow like semi trucks, you can tow like dump trucks, you can tow anything. Except for cars or giant dump trucks. Because they're too heavy, they're too big, and also they are too small. You need medium or something. This is me. I don't know. Anyway, this is just meant to tow big rigs, okay? This is not meant to tow cars. But this this one is meant to tow cars, although this one cannot tow trucks. But trucks cannot tow cars either. It can tow this though, but it cannot tow the car. But anyways, very cool looking trucks, um, for some odd reason, there's something funny I noticed. So, as far as the black one, the black version, for some odd reason, they decided to paint the air intake stacks, or the, I meant, not the stacks, the air intake thing, the thing that takes the air and then pumps it out from the smoke, these things here. Sometimes it's painted silver on the black one. But on this one, they didn't paint it silver. It's just, like, all matching. But it still looks okay, though. I mean, you can still... You, you would imagine. In fact, it even shows you... So, see the silver thing here? This is, like, the thing that takes the air or something. It's called an air... It's called an air intake. It's either an air intake stack or an air intake. Well, an air intake stack is, like, a... It looks like an exhaust stack, but it's actually an air intake stack. But the air intake, just air intake, means that it's going to have this or something. I don't know. But yeah, I really like these. Um, I really like this Western truck. Western Star tow truck. I think it's probably the coolest tow truck. I was not able to find the international one. I only... I, I, I think I... I probably missed it or something. I probably missed... Like, like I forgot... Maybe when I go to the USA, or maybe when I go to, like, a... Maybe Walmart might be able... Because when I went to Toys R Us, there's, like, so many of these real working rigs. Sometimes they have, like, a lot of these. But on the, um... But in Walmart, like, Walmart here, they don't have it. Actually, I think they do, but I wouldn't just go there because it's a little boring there. But I, but I think they are planning to have them. Anyway, this is a look, this, so this was, I hope you enjoyed this video, or a look at the Western Star 6900XD tow truck, and if you want, I can actually, if you want
want to give me a request or if you want I might be able to, like, if so, I think it's the next month they released each of these trucks. The, the, the mix, the original one, the, I think the 2018 ones, like the International Durastar or the dump truck, I, I think one of those trucks or whatever were released at somewhere around December. I don't know. I just bought these things from July. These were released in July, I guess. But, yeah. Maybe in Walmart they might actually have them, because I think they were like, I think they were planning. I don't know. Anyway, I'm pretty sure Walmart is gonna have these. Like, Walmart Canada. Because I'm actually, I actually live in Canada, by the way. This is actually Canada, where I am. And I forgot to do the Canadian 150 150, any 50, I don't know what 50 it is, 52, Canada's birthday, I forgot to do that, well, I was not able to, for some reason, anyway, it's cool how it has the Western Star, it says, A. Guires, Towing Co., and Call 247, Super Red. I forgot to actually talk about that, I think the, it's, I think the tampos are the same, but the color shade of it is a little different. But I still like it though. So I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you want, I can actually, I think the next month, maybe August, if they release the Kenworth TA-100 TA roll-off truck, I can get that one. And I might be able to get the, um, I might be able to get some, like, if they make more, like, if, if, if this does not, if they don't if they don't do what they did before, just, like, don't release them anymore. If they, if they still make more of these and they make, like, I don't know, let's say more Kenworth T-800s or more, uh, like, if they make the Oshkosh Key Series Snowplow or, or the Articulated Dump Truck, I would be happy to get that one or even the Freightliner Vacuum sort of truck. I would be happy if they had those or even the International or make it whatever matchbox you're you're the best you're way better than hot wheels although hot wheels used to be better but i think you're starting to be better on details and cars because we're getting cars like these or something that's not fair for hot wheels i mean hot wheels used to be like matchbox they used to have like like peterbilt trucks or something but now they're getting stuff like that. Come on, please, please change, okay? Although I still love Hot Wheels. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, please give a like on this video, and I will like if you subscribe. I might be able to um, like you can subscribe, and if you make a comment, like if you put a comment, uh, like. Whatever, like if you put a comment to, uh, like about the, let's say you say, um, oh, can you do a video on the Kenworth T800? I can do that. Um, well, right now they don't have it. This is like July. I think each, I think every month, every, like any month, they will release new trucks. So I think August will be Mix C, which will have the Kenworth one, the street cleaner, I don't know, and if, if the real working rigs keeps continuing on, I will, like, if they make more, uh, like, if they make the Oshkosh snowplow truck, or the dump truck, whatever, if they make everything, like, I, I can just buy it and just get it and then do a review on this. So, my third request, so, this was my secondary request. Now, my third request will be about the Kenworth T800, so, hopefully, at August, I might be able to get the Kenworth T800 roll-off truck. And I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll make more truck videos if they're special, or if I find more new stuff at Toys R Us, or more stuff at any store. Bye! Beep beep. You need to get towed. Thank you. I appreciate it.